All right, guys. Welcome back to a video. My name is Zero Fox Gaming, and we are back with another video. We are playing. Well, this is a video that I recorded a while back, but I never had the chance to really make a commentary and try and upload it and stuff. So, this is Battlefield 2042. Uh, this is a game that I have not touched in quite some time. I have not played anything else other than Warzone and Warzone 2. Hell, I even tried to play Warzone 1 tonight, and the game was choppy, the game was laggy. Um, I was losing frames. So, the number one issue that I have with Warzone right now is the constant stuttering. Uh, I have my settings on quite a bit lower than what most. I have a 3070 uh, graphics card in my my PC, so should be able to run the game pretty well so I've noticed that a lot of the latency problems that the game has is where the latency is like at one one percent or some something like that I can't I can't even think right now um, I'm only a one day off of work so there's that so it's it's confusing me because like I'm sitting here and I'll be moving and all of a sudden I'm, I'm taking like three steps back because of how much stutter that the game has and this isn't me trying to complain as much, but there's just so much things that could be fixed in the game that I feel just they're not going to do. Um, hopefully they actually come with the idea of actually making a fix for it. So, uh, the most issues that I have is when I'm streaming. Uh, I know people have, you know, better PCs than I do, and, you know, I bought, I bought this before the 40, 40 series was out, and like I said, I should be able to run this stuff like it's nothing. So I'm, I'm kind of confused. I'm kind of not understanding. Um, I'm gonna wanted to mention that I'm gonna miss a lot of shots in this game. I'm on controller, and so for me, it's kind of hard to see people in this gameplay. So, like I said, and there's a lot of AI, which at the point in time, it just wasn't really. It was confusing me why there's AI in the game, but I feel like it's it's making me not really want to play it as much, and I'm kind of lost on what to do. I know my Twitter's been really going downhill as of late. Twitter's been weird as well, so to be 100% honest with you guys, I... I'm just like sticking to myself. I'm not. I'm not asking people for help anymore. Like uh, I just don't know what else to do. Um, I don't want to, you know, put my struggles on other people because they, you know, they're busy doing their own shit. You know, Smee streaming, Ruchi's, you know, taking care of stuff that he has to take care of. Um, I've said something on Twitter, and nobody responds. Or I'll say something in Discord. Nobody's there to respond to me. So the Botrix bot is finally up and going on my kick stream. Um, finally, uh, this this commentary is all over the place already. So I'm really f trying to focus on put myself back to the point to where I'm actually enjoying playing games. Um, I didn't get too frustrated tonight, which was kind of surprising, because normally, by like like the tenth game, I'm I'm already pissed off because well, I'm dying because of the stuttering and the issues that I'm having with the game itself. So the constant issues that I have with playing and trying to stream, it's make it's, it does take a toll on me. Um, I've spent hours and hours and hours trying to figure out what I can do to fix a lot of these a lot of these issues which is which is weird because I've never felt like I've had a lot of this issue until this game has dropped the the updates I drop frames I drop you know FPS my game will fucking freeze I'll lag out I will completely and utterly get kicked out of the game or you know, it's it's pretty bad. It is re it's really bad. Um, I think I've had better chances in multiplayer than I have with you know Warzone Two. So 
I'm not I'm kind of confused on why the numbers are staying below 10 when we know damn well that's not what it is so I saw somebody I saw something on Linksy's channel about when he talked about the low FPS where maybe it was somebody else I can't remember but we're talking about how Activision came over to their house and they installed something for whatever whatever reason I don't know. It, it was funny to me. Um, but at the end of the day, guys, I'm really trying to put out content. Even if no commentaries, no, none of that shit. I, I don't know. I'm more burnt out on commentaries than I have been in the past fucking 10 years of talking. You know? Um, I feel like every game that we played the last year or so is just, you know something's wrong something's wrong with the game or you know we're constantly having to bitch and complain about the shit on twitter and it's like what's the point you know whether they fix it or not or they do whatever i mean are they gonna actually make the attempt to fix it this guy's been silent pretty much all year well besides little updates here or there you know i'm sick of these cosmetics I just want to play, you know, I just want to play a game and try and do well. That's why I fucking play Call of Duty. And this is why I've been playing Call of Duty for a long period of time. So, I feel like the game is just complete and utter bullshit now. Um, I don't know if I want to try and attempt to play 2042 or, you know, try and get into Rainbow Six Siege, you know... All these games that I could try and get into just could be worth a lot, you know? Um, Wrecking is trying to show me the way of how to play Siege because I've never really played, really got into it. Um, for me, I've been, I've been a guy who likes to rush and try and snipe and do well and put out content doing that and trying to hit quick scopes and stuff like that. But you guys just got to understand, this is something that I enjoy doing in a sense that I've spent years doing this um, like, I said, like I've said in very many commentaries you guys don't owe me shit and vice versa I don't owe you guys anything you know I'm going to be 100% honest with you I'm going to be blunt with you if you guys have questions for me you know just ask me I'll be 100% honest but the fact that I'm trying to put out these commentaries and try and bring out the you know the stuff that I normally have issues doing myself um, if you guys didn't know I didn't have I don't have teeth to talk sometimes so sometimes it sounds like I'm lisping um, or my s's sound like I'm hissing at you kind of thing but it is what it is you know I'm gonna still try and make these commentaries I'm still gonna try and you know put out content like this because this is what I enjoy doing um, sniping has been a major factor of why I am who I am today. You know, it's the the constant, you know, pushing myself to try and improve for the next day or tomorrow or yesterday. I'm trying to be better than I was yesterday, in a sense. Um, but we'll see where we are when it comes to streams we might put end up having to play multiplayer for a while um i mean i i was thinking about playing PUBG on uh ps4 and or go back and play you know on pc you know but thinking about getting a different mouse guys because or keyboard my bad keyboard it's a fucking keyboard so I'm trying to look into getting a new keyboard so I can, you know, have more of my mouse pad to work with. Um, I'll show you guys a picture at the end of the video what I'm, of what I'm talking about. I just want to let you guys know that I'm not sugarcoating shit no more. I'm not going to play this, play this off anymore. I've been quiet for a while and uh, I'm getting tired of it 
a person can only say so much before they're just like, what's the point in saying anything? You know what I'm saying? Like, there's no point. So, like I said, if you guys have questions for me, you can ask them in the comments. You guys can say whatever you, you feel you want to say. Call me a bitch. You can call me whatever. I, I really don't care at this point. I'm over being nice, and I'm over trying to downplay everyone's bullshit, so... So, like I said, you guys don't owe me shit. I don't owe you shit. That's just the way it goes. Uh, so, if you guys have anything you guys want to ask me, feel free. Um, uh, it's getting hot in the room already because it's been up in the fucking 80s. So, and then the sun hits the house all day and I'm just like, you know, blah. But, you guys are the motivation of why I can continue to do this. You know, some people would have been done. I know I have my issues of uploads. I have my issues of not wanting to upload because I don't know what to fucking post. So I tend to just make a gameplay and go with it. I don't, I don't make a commentary. I don't say anything. I just let it go. I'll, I'll type out what I need to type out. And, you know, people come to the video. They come to the video. And that's like, I just... I, it's like I'm making content for me. I, I'm done playing this whole bullshit of oh well you play this we'll you know we'll subscribe and blah blah blah. It's like motherfucker, you have not been in the channel in a long time. You know, there's still people that watch my ch watch my videos that I've known for quite a while. It's been the same people that have been on that have had my back this entire time. So, I mean. Take it as, take it as you want it. I, I'm just burnt out, burnt out on, you know. Everyone just thinking that oh it's all about me, it's about me. No, I could give a fuck a, I could give a fuck less about myself. I will, I will be in everyone's stream. That's not a problem. But the one thing that I do have an issue with is. This false support or these fake ass fucking profiles coming into my channels. That's so bad. Another thing that I want to mention before I decide whether I want to end this commentary or not. Is that if you guys come into the stream, I don't mind checking out your channel. If I like what I see, I may follow, I may subscribe, I may do whatever. But don't come in the channel asking for follow for follows guys. But that's the biggest no-no, and I, and I will ban you. I, I've had enough of that. I had, a, I had a lot of that shit when I first started streaming. Oh, I'll follow you if you follow me, blah, 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 and then we'll just we'll go with it, you know. That's not what I want to do anymore. I'm over that. I'm over that shit. So, if you guys do enjoy the video, uh, if you guys have any questions, I will... Be willing to answer them. I don't want to say that I'm in the greatest mood because I'm, I'm kind of not. I was trying to play some Warzone and try and enjoy the time that I had to play, but games were like almost 20 fucking minutes just to find a game. Um, so, I tried playing Warzone 1. Again, my stream was acting up, and I don't know. So, hopefully, you guys do enjoy the Battlefield 2042 gameplay. This was back. When I first started really playing the game and got to a game with, with a bunch of AIs. Again, I hope you guys do enjoy. I'm going to end my commentary here. Um, the gameplay is over like 16 minutes. This is a long gameplay. I'm surprised I was even able to talk this long without any... Well, I had to stop once, but... It is what it is, guys. So, I will see you guys soon with another video. And take care, everybody. I'm the Raging Fox, or Zero Fox Gaming, guys. And I'm out. Take care.